we present AutoInt, Automatic Integration for Fast Neural Volume Rendering. Integration is a fundamental concept at the core of science and engineering and ubiquitous in computer vision applications. Among these applications, neural volume rendering has recently been proposed as a new paradigm for view synthesis, achieving photorealistic image quality. This technique involves evaluating integrals along rays through a learned volume in order to render a scene. However, evaluating these rays is computationally inefficient, requiring millions of queries to a neural network to sample each ray, approximate the integrals, and render an image. In this work, we propose a new method for computationally efficient neural volume rendering by learning closed form solutions to integrals using neural networks. Key to our method are an emerging class of implicit neural representation networks. These networks parameterize a signal or function of interest by learning a mapping from the low-dimensional input space of the function to the low-dimensional output. For example, pixel coordinates to pixel values in an image. Our method learns to evaluate integrals over functions defined by such implicit neural representations. In general, finding closed form solutions to derivative calculations is a far easier task than solving integrals in closed form. For example, the chain rule is a simple yet powerful tool that enables calculating derivatives on large computational graphs and training neural networks through backpropagation. Unfortunately, finding closed form solutions for integrals can be extremely challenging or even impossible requiring expert application of heuristics or extremely complex algorithms like the Riesz algorithm. Instead, integrals are often approximated numerically through techniques like Riemann sums, quadrature, or Monte Carlo sampling. Still, these sampling-based methods come with a fundamental trade-off between accuracy and runtime based on the number of samples used to approximate the integration. AutoInt allows calculating learned definite integrals with two evaluations of a neural network rather than hundreds required with techniques like Monte Carlo integration. To calculate integrals with AutoInt, we introduce the concept of an integral network, phi, which is an implicit neural representation that can be realized by a multilayer perceptron, or MLP. Now, we observe that evaluating the derivative of the output of this network with respect to one of its inputs corresponds to evaluating a new computational graph. This is a new implicit neural representation with the same parameters as the integral network, but with a different architecture. We call this new representation the grad network, psi. A key insight is that we can train the grad network to represent signals. After, we use the learned weights to reassemble the integral network, which, by construction, represents an antiderivative of the fitted signal. Now, by the fundamental theorem of calculus, we observe that the integral network phi is an antiderivative of the grad network, psi. Thus, we can calculate a definite integral of any signal represented by psi by evaluating phi at the two bounds of integration. In summary, AutoInt involves the following procedure. First, one specifies the architecture of the integral network. The grad network is instantiated, with the computational graph corresponding to the partial derivative of the integral network output with respect to the input variable of integration. Then, the grad network is trained to fit the signal to be integrated. Finally, the integral network is reassembled using the trained parameters. As an example, consider that we wish to integrate this one-dimensional signal. We fit the grad network to the signal with direct supervision. Then, we reassemble the integral network and querying its outputs results in the following 1D signal, which is an integral up to the input coordinate. Thus, evaluating a definite integral corresponds to subtracting the network output at the two bounds of integration. Now let us see how AutoInt can be used to evaluate integrals in two dimensions for computed tomography. Here we wish to integrate along parallel rays through the simulated 2D phantom. As we calculate integrals along rays at varying angles, we can create an image of projections, also called a sinogram. The integral equation that computes these projections is called the radon transform. For this example, suppose that we have, as measurements, a sparse collection of projections, and our goal is to estimate the projections at unobserved angles. We choose this problem setup because it is analogous to the novel view synthesis problem that we will show in three dimensions hereafter. During training, the grad network is supervised directly on the sparse projections by approximating the integral with Monte Carlo sampling. After training, we reassemble the integral network and evaluate the integrals corresponding to the projections at all angles. This allows us to inpaint the missing projections. Since the grad network contains the derivative of the activation function used in the integral network, the choice of activation function has a large impact on performance. 
we find that smooth nonlinearities, such as Swish, have better fitting and generalization properties with AutoInt than Sign, Softplus, or ReLU, especially for sparse supervision of 8 times subsampling, or 16 times subsampling. Finally, we demonstrate AutoInt for the application of three-dimensional rendering. We aim to render scenes by evaluating the volume rendering equation shown here. We render each pixel by casting a ray through the volume and integrating the absorption, transmittance, and emissive radiance or color along the ray. Since this equation contains nested integrals, we cannot immediately apply AutoInt. Instead, we introduce a piecewise approximation to learn efficient closed form solutions to integrals along sections. So at inference time, rather than approximating the integral along the ray with hundreds of forward passes through a neural network, we evaluate it efficiently using AutoInt for each piecewise section along the ray. Varying the number of sections in our piecewise approximation thus offers a trade-off between the quality of the novel view synthesis and its computational requirements. Here we show rendered views using AutoInt for 4, 8, 16, 32, and 64 piecewise sections on a synthetic scene rendered in Blender. We achieve better image quality with more sections, but faster render times with fewer sections. AutoInt achieves high image quality on these synthetic test set views while reducing render times by more than 10 times relative to NERF. Our approach also accurately renders surfaces with challenging reflectance properties better than neural volumes, a method using a convolutional encoder and a voxel grid. We also demonstrate AutoInt on captured datasets. In summary, we have presented AutoInt, a new method for learning closed-form integral solutions. We believe AutoInt will be of interest for a wide variety of application areas in and outside of computer vision, especially for problems related to inverse rendering, sparse view tomography, and compressive sensing.